Hey guys, it's me, Jen, and I wanted to do a video for you guys today on the Easy Poser app. I've been making a lot of videos about this app. I promise I'm not sponsored. I just think it's really awesome. And I wanted to highlight in this one how to pose more than one character on the screen and make them interact with each other. So I'm going to show you how I do that. The first thing you want to do is get one person up there. I'm going to do like a mom holding a child. That's, that's what I'm in the mood to do today. So the first thing that we need is a mom. So let's get this girl up here. We're going to do her like this. And then let me just show you guys real quick how to move these people around. If you want to rotate this woman, you highlight her pelvis area and you use the middle one to kind of rotate her back and forth. If you want to move her whole body, you come down to the lower uh, left hand side and you see this little figure, you highlight that and then she's highlighted completely. And this way you can make her move for, for, uh, right to left, up and down, or back to front. So that's how that works. I get a lot of questions about how to take their clothes on and off. You can only do this when they're in this mode. As soon as you put them in color, you can't take their clothes off. But if you look down here by her feet, you're going to see a little pair of shorts next to an orange square. If you click that orange square, that means you take their clothes on and off. So that's how you do that. So I'm going to go in here and get another figure. So I'm going to go back to here where it's add model. And there are some really adorable little chibi looking models. Let me just try to find them. Where are they? Here they are. So we're going to get a little girl and we're going to put her in. I'm going to try to find a pose that I think is going to be the easiest for us to use. I'm going to use this one where she's sitting down. So this looks a little bit weird right now, but what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on her and I'm going to move her forward a little bit. Oops, sorry. And then I'm going to unclick her and then click on her little, little underwear. And then I'm going to spin her around like this. And now the, the rest of the video, I'm just going to show you how I manipulate these two to make a picture. So I'm going to have this either sped up or have music over it but you can see what I'm doing. So it will teach you how to learn. I've taught you guys the basics, so now it's just a lot of manipulations. So let's begin. 